it's been a while, but today we're going to do something a bit different. If you remember back to a previous video of mine, I mentioned that I was going to use Skype to collab with Brizzy and Anna O'Connor, and this is that video. <laughs> Anna O'Connor narrated it, and Brizzy did these amazing little voices that were so cute and put it in there, um, and I drew all the videos out. And I had such a fun time putting this together with Anna and Brizzy. They are just the loveliest of people. So I'm really grateful they helped us do this collab, and I'm excited to show you guys. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> so let's get started. Our story begins in a small town of Aria. Beyond the forest and next to the old barn was a curious creature named Brian. Brian is a dinosaur cat. He is creative, friendly, and can make amazing snowflake cookies. Yum. But he's lonely. He tried his best to make friends, but the pandas in his village never seemed to want to be around him. There was one point he thought they liked him when they named him Mr. Onion of the Year. But it turned out they were just playing a prank. Brian fell into a sad sleep, but his Teddy met him in his dreams and showed him just how wonderful he thought he was. Teddy let him know that if he wasn't around, Teddy would be lonely and uncared for. When Brian woke up, he looked at Teddy and smiled. Knowing that he meant something to someone filled him with confidence. He couldn't make everyone like him, but as long as he was the best dino cat he could be, that's all that mattered to him. However, the townspeople began to take notice that something was different. They were still scared of Brian, but since he wasn't so busy worrying about what people thought about him, he started paying more attention to what was going on around him. He saw a burning building and rushed to help. He stopped two planes from crashing into each other. He helped reunite a man with his pet frog, stopped a volcano from erupting with just one breath, and stopped a bank robbery getaway car before it could get away. Once Brian reached his barn that afternoon, he looked behind him. There was the whole town looking at him. Huh? Their eyes were not scornful. He saw no pitchforks or spoons. Brian was baffled. All he knew was that maybe being different wasn't so bad. You're a kind dino cat, aren't you? Uh-huh. All this time, we thought you were going to hurt us. But today, you saved us. We're sorry we didn't see sooner. You're not scary. You're a hero. Now, Brian is happy, has a friend in each of the townspeople, and he and Teddy took the mayor's position when he retired. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video because I've always wanted to do something with the dinosaur cat. I don't know why. Um, yeah, but just as a reminder, there is a video like this on Anna Connor's channel as well as Brizzy's channel because we all did it one on each channel. Um, and again, thank you so much to Skype for commissioning this because we would not have been able to do it without Skype. I'm a huge fan girl of Skype just because it was my savior during my long distance relationship and now I'm getting married and it's incredible. Um, yeah, but check out the other videos and I'll see you next week. <laughs> Bye!